Buenos dias. Um, it is currently Sunday the 15th of May. Um, as you can tell, Tenerife Partido. Um, so today, it is Tenerife, Siri Tenerife, against Malaga. Um, a very important game for us because I believe if we win, it all but is certain to have clinched us a playoff spot. Um, but if we win, it keeps the pressure on Ibar and Valladolid. Sorry, I'm a wee bit of a rush to catch the, catch the bus here. Um, yeah, if we win, we continue to push for automatic promotion. Keep, we keep the pressure on Ibar and Valladolid. Uh, Valladolid won two nights ago. So they've jumped up into second. Ibar have dropped into third. Um, so we didn't lead the win as normal. Um, Malaga, they're, they're on an average form. They're, again, Malaga before, played in the top division for quite a while. Uh, but they've also been in the second division for a while at the same time. Um, so I, but I believe they're roughly they're in the bottom half of the table. Um, so I'm not. It's not going to be a, an easy game, but it's certainly going to be a lot easier than the games against such as Ibar, Vadelid, and Almeida and stuff like that. So all I can say is just vamos Teti. Let's get the bus, and as per usual, let's head to Santa Cruz. Vamos! Currently eight minutes past seven. Lineups for, for the match are out. So here we go. Lineups. Let's see what we got. Who we got, Jim? So it's sorry, Anna was can't play because he said a booking suspension. Yeah, he got a red card. So we've got Hernandez and goal. Melo. Melo right back. Best right back ever. Right. Okay. Even better than Shaq Ward this year. You think? I think. Yeah. Right, oh, Just about full production. Right. Next up, we've got uh, Carlos Ruiz and Leon at the back. I, I would prefer. I'd Sergio Gonzalez, right. he's on the bench. Then we've got Tamares at left back. Mm -hmm. Munoz, of course, is getting rested. Uh, Mayeko, Corredera, Sainz, yeah. and Zoria. Right. Hey, top the hey, okay. middle four. That's a strong midfield. And Gallego and Gonzalez. So, effectively, we've got a strong, a strong midfield. A strong attack. And a strong attack. And a little bit of a weak defence. Because I don't know about Ruiz. How long, when was the last time you played Ruiz? Hasn't he played in a good, a good couple four months? Weeks, four, four weeks probably. Four weeks. So about a month, month and a half or something. Um, Ruiz hasn't he played, so... A wee bit different, but again, just try to rest players for the final couple of games, because we've got uh, Ibar next, and Card again in the final game of the yeah. season, Yeah. So... Again, tactics by Ruiz, try to save players, so we'll see if it works out. But again, we won't know until... Oh, we've got, we've got, got a strong bench there. We've got a strong bench, who's on the bench? Sam on the bench. Right, so we've got Victor Mendes, Medima, Gonzalez, Moore, Sipsic, Rodriguez. Rodriguez Macho, Leiva, Jameli, Martin, Herrera and Teto. So the no only 
Just was injured. He's still injured, right? Okay. So no get no no get Sam. No Munoz. You haven't got the English miss. Um, Larry is out for the season. Yeah, no, 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 no. So. It'll be a tough game, but it'll be a tough game, but at the end of the day, I'm almost steady. Hello, Hello. 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 Jambo, score prediction. 3 1. 1. Jambo's going for a 3 1. 10 8, I presume. Oh, come on, yeah. Um, I'm going to go with uh, a 2 0 10 8 1. Um, and I think there's going to be a goal in both halves. Both goals. One goal each half. Like, as in. One goal for the one goal for the one. Well, I'm almost 30.
Nine minutes completed. Well, actually, 96. Six minutes, but uh, 98, no, 98 minutes in total. Two minutes added on for the end of first half, and then six. Um, I've, got, I've got one word for that game. No, no, I've got three. Ref from Ree was Otter. Crap, that's four actually, sorry, four, right. Well, I'll allow it on this channel. Um, aye, referee, horrendous chauffeur. Um, I think he forgot his cards. Um, especially the common six second rule with the goalkeeper. I understand, obviously, that like, he can give a wee bit of leeway out there, right? But as a goalkeeper himself, uh, it took far too long and so many things. It was even time wasting within, time wasting within fucking five minutes. Honestly, um, but uh, we just make it hard for ourselves. We're ten eighth. That's what we do. So final score in the end. We're still going to get playoffs. Hopefully, Aye. final score in the end was two 0 to Malaga. Um, I bar next away. I bar away. Great. And then, uh, I bar second in the league. Second in the league. And then can't again. But again, can't write off. Can't write off. Can't again. Again, because we can't write off Malaga exactly. So anyway. Vamos Teti, we move. Si se puede. Si se puede. Si se puede. Right, well, ask me off the bus. Heading back to the apartment just now. Um, so again, just a little summary and a little outro. Uh, game, that was absolutely horrendous. We played utter, utter shocking. Um, we just couldn't, we just couldn't get the ball in the net. That was it, evidently. Um, but again, it's football. And us being Tenerife, we make everything harder than it needs to be. So now. We are five points clear of fifth place, um, with six games in hand. Uh, six games, nah, six points up for grabs with two games remaining. So realistically, playoffs are all but secured. Um, now it's just a test to see if Ramis is going to play it tactical and try and go for the third place spot, um, or if he's going to stay for the fourth, because obviously third will play sixth and fourth will play fifth. Um, the way it's going now, I'd much rather keep the fourth place spot because um, if we play, if we finish fourth, we play against Real Oviedo, um, and if we play, if we finish third, we play against Girona. And Girona, obviously, have been in the top flight for the past couple of seasons. They've had their stints. The World class striker Christian Stuani. So realistically. Okay. Um, realistically, I'd much prefer to play against the Real Oviedo and then play against Girona in the final. Um, and let's just hope that Girona beat Valladolid because Valladolid are a very dangerous team. Um, but hey, that's football. And yet again, vamos Teti. We'll see you all in the next one. Um, I don't know what the next vlog is going to be, but you know, only time we tell. Most likely. The next vlog is going to be a, a race weekend vlog at Not Kill in two weeks' time. So, going to round it off here. Um, thank you all very much for watching. From everyone that you are in the world, have a wonderful night and a great day. Peace out.